video is going to show you how to assign a Google LTI assignment in Canvas. So the first thing that we want to do is we want to open up our document that we want to assign students. Um, so I'm going to choose this U.S. Regions Map um, assignment. So we want to check our share settings because when we assign it, uh, we want the students to be able to view it. So if you look down here where it says Get Link, right now this Google assignment is restricted. Um, so only people added can open with this link. And we want to change this to Suffolk Public Schools. So that way anyone in Suffolk Public Schools can view this document. So we're going to press Done. I'm going to exit out of this and go back to Canvas. So we're going to add the assignment. You can add the assignment a couple different ways, um, but I'm just going to go to the Assignments tab. I'm going to press plus assignment here at the top right. right. And then we're prompted to give our assignment a name. I'm just going to name this Practice Map Assignment. You can enter a description here um, for anything, directions that you want students to know. Um, you can add the point value, the assignment group, if you have groups in your um, course. So I'm just going to leave it as classwork. How you want to display the grades and then submission type. So when we get to submission type, we want to choose external tool. Okay? And then this will open up. And so it's going we're going to want to link our Google assignment here. So I'm going to choose find. And then I get this these list of external tools. And I'm going to find Google Assignments LTI 1.3. I'm going to click continue and it'll open up a new window. In this new window, I'm going to click attach. I'm going to go to my drive and then here's this U.S. Regions map assignment that I was just looking at. I'm going to click add and then it's there. And so it will automatically make a copy for each student if I do it this way. Okay, um, You can you check for plagiarism here, choose the total points, you can add a due date here, and also a rubric. I'm not going to add any of those, but they are options. I'm going to click Create. All right, and so this, when this window pops back up, it's really important to click Select again. If you click the X or you click out, um, it will not upload the assignment correctly. So I'm going to choose Select. And then I see that there is a link in here, so that means that um, I uploaded the assignment correctly. And I'm also going to click Load this tool in a new tab. If I, if you don't click that, the assignment will load into within Canvas. Um, but I want to open up a new tab so that way students have um, a wider window to see the assignment. And then we have more settings. Um, how many attempts do you want to give students? I'm going to give them unlimited attempts. Um, and then you can assign it to specific students here, um, choose a due date, when you want it to be available from, etc. So I'm going to save and publish. Okay, and then I'm going to go back to assignments, even though it, up, it uploaded there. Um, and this is the assignment that we just looked at, the practice map assignment. So for Google Assignments, the speed grader will not work. Um, to grade a Google assignment, you're going to have to click Load Practice Map Assignment in a new window. And then this is where I will see student submissions. So if um, I had a student submit it, I would um, see their name and I would be able to open it um, and grade it there. Okay. And this concludes our video on how to upload a Google assignment to Canvas.